My name is Nicole Lipper from Priorities Product Team. This demo will go over Priorities financial management functionality, which provides companies with the tools they need to be profitable, successful, and achieve regulatory compliance, both at the managerial level and the operational level. Priority offers various financial capabilities, including AR, AP, revenue recognition, budget planning and control, cash flow, project accounting, financial statements, and many more. We chose a few highlights to show you today. So let's start with the digital AR process. Priority Payments, an end-to-end -end customer payment solution, combines advanced digital payment functionality with smart tools to streamline customer payments. Organizations can provide their customers with a whole digital payment experience in a self-service model. Priority Payment reduces outstanding accounts receivables, optimizes cash flow, enhances the customer's experience with frictionless payments, and streamlines the payment processing from billing to reconciliations. Let's, let's see some of Priority's payments capabilities. The end customer can easily pay their invoice by clicking on the secure payment button on the invoice they received and then recording their credit card details on a secure PCI compliant page. Obviously, all credit cards and other payment means are acceptable including PayPal, SEPA, ACH, and Apple Pay from any platform, desktop or mobile. End customers may also use Priorities Payments Portal to manage and pay all their open invoices and review recent payments. The organization using Priority can make use of a dedicated dashboard presenting all the relevant info regarding payments received from customers. Collection processes can be undergone within the system or using integrated visual and automated tools. If we're already on the topic of revenue, I'd like to talk about the different ways in which Priority allows us to recognize revenue. Revenue recognition is a generally accepted accounting practice that identifies the specific conditions in which revenue is recognized and determines how to account for it. Priority's robust revenue recognition tool allows identifying the customer's contract, the performance obligations, the recognition principle, including its timing, and the fair value of the contract. Based on this, a recognition plan is put into motion and the revenue is automatically recognized in the books when the performing party meets the performance obligation. We briefly presented parts of the AR process in priority. We'll now talk about the digital AP side. Automation and intelligence in the AP arena have long become an industry standard, replacing manual processing of multiple documents. An example of that in priority is the automatic scanning of invoices using advanced OCR capabilities enriched with machine learning for automatic conversion of them to verified invoices in the system, saving loads of time and minimizing human error. Using artificial intelligence, the system learns and improves as time goes by, gradually refining the automation to perfection. Another example of the automation of the AP process further down the line has to do with payments. Of course, the payment process in priority is automized as well, using direct connection to banking system for real-time data communication. To enable this experience for our users, priority is connected to market leaders in various territories, for example, Plaid for the North American market. Digital banking saves manual work, eliminates human errors, and gives the company immediate access to the real bank statement and the ability to process payments to vendors directly from priority. So, we witnessed a few examples of automatic AR and AP processes that resulted in raw financial transactions in the system. We can now 
shine some light on various aspects of the company's financial activity using different perspectives to achieve maximum visibility. One of these is Priority's comprehensive profit center capabilities. Profit centers represent legal entities, product lines, projects, or any other revenue generating business unit. In Priority, every income and expense can be simultaneously linked to multiple profit centers to gain a better understanding of profitability from different perspectives. All direct income and expenses are automatically linked to profit centers, making it possible to manage them as independent P&L entities. Indirect expenses go to cost centers and are later on automatically distributed to profit centers using various rules and algorithms. The multidimensional structure of the ledger facilitated by the profit centers allows us to see a sophisticated P&L displaying both the company level and the business division bottom lines at the same time. I'd like to focus on a use case for a projectile company and talk a little bit about project accounting. Project incorporates all the related business and financial activities, providing real-time project tracking and monitoring of the financial health of the project. Some of the financial parameters that can be evaluated, as you see here, are the actual and projected profitability that is based on actual and projected revenue and cost. This data is a direct result of all business activities, including the financial and logistic transactions that were billed or are expected to be billed, including reported work hours, raw material issues to production, customer invoices, journal entries, and more. Now, let's see if our financial planning for the project was at all aligned with the end result. This view unveils the total planned, actual, and projected costs of the different project activities, providing the company with the ability to track and successfully maintain the budget. This area is typically used by the PMO to perform project period closing. However, when online budgetary control is required for the project expenses, Customers incorporate the budget control capabilities alongside the project management tools. The budget control process begins with budget planning, which is carried out in priority on the basis of previous periods actuals or via seamless integration with dedicated third-party applications such as JDocs, but ultimately can also be performed with the help of spreadsheets. The budget in priority is highly configurable, managed by versions, supported by approval processes, providing the organization the flexibility it requires to build a multi-level and multi-company budget according to their specific needs. I'd like to state the obvious and convey that priority is equipped with all the necessary financial reports to ensure compliance with local regulation and to give stakeholders an accurate depiction of a company's financial status, such as P&L that we saw before, balance sheet and trial balance, both for individual legal entities or in a consolidated manner. On top of that, companies may configure their own reports using our flexible self-service financial statement generator. Let's have a glimpse at the CFO's outlook on the consolidated financial information. The CFO's dashboard organizes financial and operational data into one central hub. Data from various priority ERP modules are available in one place, enabling you to click through consolidated data from multi-company or individual company-wide totals, all the way to detailed information about each and every transaction. By using this dashboard, the CFO can monitor business health, identify potential cash flow issues, and make data-driven informed decisions. So as we saw today, and in conclusion, Priority offers various financial capabilities as were presented in this demo, and of course, additional capabilities such as fixed assets, loan management, and many more. Thank you very much.